It's like, damn, I should take a picture because I look good. I look damn good. I do. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I love, this is my brand new pink shirt. This is so cute. And these are the pink pants. They're from last year. They are old. I know, I know. The shame of it. They're old pants. Oh, it's absolutely gorgeous out. My nose will not stop running. Will not. They blend in so much. Where the hell are you going? Yeah, I'm talking to the ball. Yeah. Yeah, you're the dumbass. It even talks back. Hey, come on. All right, staying over there. <laughs> so then it's a little later, and then the problem is all the dog walkers come out, and then the dogs get scare my um, squirrels. There goes squirrel cam. The sun is super bright. Now on the good side of the court. Hang on. Wait. Because <coughs> the other side, the sun isn't too much. You know what? I gotta put my hair up. Hold on. I just want it to look good. At least for Instagram. Because here, you guys love me. I don't have to look my absolute best. I, the only thing bad about the pink shirts that, with the hood, the hood, it catches in my hair and it knots it up and it's so annoying. <clears throat> but winter's coming and the hood is good to have. And this is so cute. It's just so cute. I had to have it. So cute. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, it's so cute. I had a lot of cute things. I was like, I got to save something to buy for Black Friday. Ugh. I'm getting something in the mail for Macy's for the Black Friday. Starting early? What? That kind of kills it. I, I miss the old fashioned Black Fridays. I really miss when we used to give away stuff to the first hundred people in line. Now that was fun. I mean, standing in line five hours for free freaking Hershey bar. Now come on. That's living. That is living. <laughs> that sounds so fun. And everybody would get so excited. Target used to hand out candy and treats. Here we all are, freezing our asses off. I was like, oh, candy's coming. Oh, candy, candy, five more hours, we're good. Give me that candy bar. It's crazy. I love it. I freaking love it. Like, here's a little candy. Keep going. You only got six more hours till the door open. Those are the good old days. Oh my God, remember when our very, very first Black Friday, we never heard of this. Well, you know what it was too? We never had a car. And it was, it was the second Christmas we had a car because like the first time my mom was at work and she was like, her friend came back from the Black Friday. And I was like, what is all this stuff? She says, it's Black Friday. We never had a car. Oh, what the hell's this? She says, these stores, they give away stuff. I'm like, oh shit, we're there next year. So the following year, it was our first Black Friday, it was Kmart. And they gave away um, bags, not it was cute paper Christmas bag filled with traits. And no one was there, no one was there. So my mother, <laughs> she wound up with three bags for her grandchildren, which she never had. But she kept sweet talking the guy to give her some more bag because no one was, was there. We we're like the only crazy people at that time. And then after that, it was like word of mouth spread and forget about it. I mean, remember 
JC Penny used to give out the Disney snow globes. I never got one. Never. Never. The lines were too long and I always preferred Macy's sales. Macy's gave out, was it $10 off of a $20 purchase? So it was like, oh my God, it was like crazy. That was awesome. That, that was the best, but it was nice when they gave away free gifts. Oh my God, remember the year that they, um, JCPenney gave out buttons? That was like the first year they discontinued the Disney Globes. Everyone was pissed and they did some kind of a button contest. And we went crazy to get these freaking cheap ass nickel penny buttons. We got, we got like a hundred freaking buttons. Oh my God, I remember that. Yeah, that whole mall closed in New York. There's no more JC Penney. There's no more JC Penney. Oh, that's where we went to Newport. Newport. I forgot about that. Oh yeah, I forgot. See, Newport's great, but I mean I have to take I have to take a bus and then a train. It's just not you know, this is like at what four in the morning and it's not the greatest area. Oh my god, I was in the Uber the other day and we're talking about places to live. I talked about the weirdest thing from my Uber driver. They're like um, psychologists. We talk about everything. And he's like, oh, Jersey City. He says, you know, it's the hood. I'm like, really? He said, yeah, it's the hood now. I'm like, okay. He's like, yeah. He's like, it's no good. <laughs> That's where my people come from. We <laughs> all come from Jersey City. We come from the hood. That's so funny. And I thought it like, Newport Center area is good, but I mean, they got really expensive houses down there because you're paying because you're next to the city. Down there, you take the path train, which I've never ridden on. I was like tempted to ride on it just to say that, but we stopped at once. End up. I think you end up like at Wall Street. I, I guess it goes underwater, right? It must. Where does it go over the George Washington Bridge? I have no idea. <laughs> it doesn't have its own tunnel. <clears throat> I have no idea. We hit the eight minute mark. 15 seconds and they were applauding me. Shoot. All right, what are we gonna talk about? Oh my God, so I wanted to see. I'll tell you, I'll tell you how much I weigh on the next video, but I was comparing. I wasn't comparing, what happened was I was looking on the thing, the phone, and it popped up, you know, videos from last year. And it was literally one year today that I posted my first Squid Game video that went viral. I found the original uncut version. I was like, oh, wow. Of course I'm watching it to see if I look thinner or fatter, but so I kicked out two new new versions of it, see if they go viral, but that was cool. That was really cool. All right, guys, have a great day. We'll do some more chit chat later and I'll tell you how much I weigh. Bye.